So I wake up today and I was saying to myself, today is a perfect day, you know what I'm saying? There's nothing that can go wrong today, bro, because I have school to do. There's nothing can go wrong. I go on Twitter. I was scrolling to the trending, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I'm torching myself going to the trending page. Anytime you go to the trending page, there might be something good or there might be something bad. And I saw Belle Delphine. I said to myself, why is this e-girl trending, you know what I'm saying? Why is he trending? So I picked on it and it said, my perfect first date. And I said, and I looked on my picture and I said to myself, I did it. I really messed my life up. I, I I just ended my day, bro. Like, bro, when I saw this, I was I, I can't I can't even put this in words, bro. <laughs> True. Showed her tied up with tape over her mouth. The second picture showed her feet tied up. The third picture showed her for JJ. I can't definitely not show that on YouTube. And the fourth and finally picture show her boyfriend putting his, you know what I'm saying, in her for JJ. And I'm saying to myself, bro, what is this, bro? What am I looking at, bro? Can someone tell me what am I looking at? And the comments are, the kink isn't the problem. It's the fact that it's posted on a public social media without any warning tags or consent, con censorship. Posting blur or sense censored image with click here to see more is different than her surprising watch me get raped. <clears throat> and then I said to myself, this girl is like speaking facts, bro. Cause she, she could have posted on her OnlyFans. She posted on the Twitter where millions of people can see. I mean, if she would have posted on her OnlyFans, she wouldn't get no backlash, you know what I'm saying? She wouldn't get no None of that, you know what I'm saying? Because OnlyFans is private, you know what I'm saying? You have to like pay to get to see her private stuff, so it's private.